Hello, this is Minecraft Static122. Welcome back to another episode of the series we love. Well, I'm not sure if we love it, but my older series, well, by time, not by episodes, 3FL. So, welcome back to another episode. It's been a long time since we've actually made a video on this, so I decided to make one today. But. The servers kind of restarted, and we've kind of already started a little base and stuff. We've got our epic swimming pool with our diving board all the way up there. That we just jumped down into there. We've got an automatic um, sugarcane farm thing here. It gets quite a bit of sugarcane, as you can probably tell. There was like way less before the last time I checked. Um, got random chests here which won't be here when I've actually finished the actual base and well we as in Bruce Mafia and I'm getting really low frame rate which is horrible but anyway we're going to go down to the actual base so I'll make this a hidden staircase which will be pretty epic then we come in here that won't be there and it says welcome to Bruce Mafia space Enjoy your stay, so pretty cool. Looks nice and fancy. And then we go in here, then we've got this little area where our rooms will be. So that's X Destroy X's room, my new dinos, and of course my room. Which I've kind of done this so far, so it just looks like I've got a tiny room, but I'll make this bigger. And then you just go into this ch no not the chest. You go into the minecart if you can get into it. I might have to go on this way. Why won't it let me in? This is not good. Okay. Can I? Oh, I clicked on my bed. If I can get in, then I will be able to show everyone how to do this. So if you've got a raid by base, you'll know how to get in here. Not that you would do it this way. Okay, stuff that. I'll just try it one more time. Actually, I'll maybe I'd help if the minecart was there. So that's probably the problem. So I'll put this back and then get my lovely stair and actually get into the minecart. And then you just hit shift jump forward and then you're out and then if you hit this late actually I probably should close this first that's the way to get up but if you hit this lever it just um like makes this so there's a hole there so there's not that much redstone to it if I can get into that I think the hole is here yeah so not that much redstone it just goes up to the lever that way and it comes in here goes around everywhere so basically this one extends to push the block up but it like this one pushes it to the position so it can get powered so it's pretty awesome and yeah so now I will get out of here and then I will go through the rest of the base So, just jump down here, go into some water. This way is the actual exit. Up there, there's a lever to get out. And then we come into here. Pretty nice. I like it, at least. I really like these big pillar thingies. It just looks amazing. I still have to do the roof in here. I've done the floor just recently. I've got all this junk out here just because I've been mining a lot and stuff. Not that they're full, I just spread them around. Just shift click into whichever chest I want. And now I also have to mine all this all out up to there. And then this will be like where all our farms and all that type of stuff will lead off to. So I reckon this looks pretty epic. I kind of did that shape on purpose and then I kind of did it up on this floor but it's kind of different so I'm guessing I'm just going to keep doing that around the place so yeah this is um 
a pretty good base so far. And also, I got this Unbreaking Free Sword for one diamond, which is pretty good considering it's only Unbreaking Free, and also it costs it's like three diamonds just to make picks, so that's a pretty good deal. Yeah, and this is easier to get out of than all the other ladders in my old world, like the old base, so that's good. This just looks, I don't know why, it just looks cool in here. So I'll have to do the stairs and all that type of stuff. And someone wants to come to my base. But you can see it on YouTube when I finish recording. So anyway, this is our chest order at the moment. I'm gonna have it down in our actual base and it'll be bigger, obviously. So you just put your junk in here and then it sorts out what I've told him before, but whatever. If I can type it. Okay, that that's done. So another chicken. I like the chicken. I want to kill it though. But yeah, we've got a bit of wool in here. Just different colors. We've got more wool somewhere. But we've got a village where we've breeded them and like that all. It's like keeps of them, but I can't get to it now because one of my um brothers has that as as home now. Oh. Oh. PVP series. That. So wait, what was I saying? I was saying something about yeah the villagers. So we've been trading with them. So that's fun. Oh yeah. If you want to know how this works, pretty much, um, when the sugar cane grows, like, it makes a block update which powers that, the pistons, and then it just, like, pushes it off, and then hopefully it goes into the water stream. Normally it stays there, or it gets there, I just have the glass here so I can actually see, and I couldn't be stopped putting glass blocks, so yeah. But I'm gonna make an app, like a bigger one, and it'll be just all closed up. So, yeah. And let's. I think I showed you this before. I've already got quite a few in there since I was um, up here before. And then in here, we've got 40 of these. I think some got used, and our diamonds. And obviously we have our rare birch saplings in here because you know you need those and you're on flesh anyway so we've got a zombie here and we're gonna kill it oh yeah also we're building like a massive castle wall thingy majiggy around our base so it'll be pretty awesome when that's done and look who we have here x destroyer x so maybe I can ask him if we can go to the village. Can I go to the village? I should probably just talk to him in real life. As I'm just... He's an arm's length away from me right now. What's he got to say? Oh, he said, sure. Wait, why am I saying TPX that, that would be just retarded okay so this is our village we've got like three golems spawn already pretty epic so we don't really have to worry about the zombies because they just come in and kill them except sometimes we accidentally hit the villagers and then that's when disaster happens they just get you straight away so yeah we just trade with the villagers and yeah and well we've got 50 emeralds at the moment just in here oh maybe he took them give me the emeralds where do you put them oh, on there just put them in the chest so everyone can actually see it put it in the chest put it in the chest what are you doing 
Ah, I got 40 of them. You've still got 10. But I think that's still believable that we have that many emeralds. So this was the village I had a house over there, trying to get them to spawn. Started working a little bit, but then this thing, it's just epic. I've got a bit of a sugarcane farm over there, because you always need a sugarcane farm. And let's see what this villager has to offer. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. So if anyone wants Bane of Arthropods and Unbreaking 2, just tell me and I'll be able to get you the sword. They're in love. The two golems. Uh, and speaking of golems, I'm thinking of making an iron farm, so that'll be useful on this server. Because we need a lot of iron for um, making hoppers, really, for the um, storage area that I'm going to make. Yeah, so I guess this is the first episode of our second series of Free or Fall or Gone PvP, which I'm not sure what I'm going to call it now. But anyway, thanks for watching this video. It's only a short one because, yeah, it's just the first one. So I hope you um, like this video. Make sure to leave a like, um, comment, and you can say bad stuff if you want to, as long as it helps me, because you need to know what's bad about your videos. And obviously, like, the quality is not as good as it could be because of how bad my computer is. So, yeah. And thanks for watching this. Um, make sure to subscribe and get us up to 500. So thanks for watching, and see ya.